I guess we're going on to chapter two, rescue. All right. I don't know why my file already has chapter two. This supposed to be a let's play file, but for some reason, I think someone's been playing it. It's kind of unusual. What we got here? Oh, we got Rise. R Rise? Yeah. I don't know. His I, I don't know a voice from. Oh, Titania. So this is where you've been, is it? Rise. Are you sure you're well enough to be up? Yes. My fever is completely gone. Are you sure? You look a bit unsteady on your feet if you ask me. Well, I've been in bed for almost a week. I doubt anyone would be in top form, even you, my friend. I certainly hope that's all it is. In any case, until you're back at full speed, you won't be doing any work. We mer we'll mer we're mercenaries after all, and... Even the smallest, oh, even the smallest lapse invites death, right? I know, I know. My apologies to the rest of the team, then. It looks like I'll be recuperating for a while longer. Hmm, it is for the best. Take your time and get fully rested and restored. You are, you are our sole staff wielder, Rise. The harder you work, the more we depend on you to be on our sides. Thank you for your kind words. Oh, by the way, that paper you've been carrying around, is that a letter? I'll, I'd intended to go into town this afternoon. I can deliver for you if you like. Oh, no. This letter's for you, Titania. For me? No more than a little while ago, I went out for a walk around the yard and... A man I've never seen before came up to me and said, Give this to the Red Trested Knight. How curious. I wonder what it is. I imagine it's a thank you letter from the people of Caldia or something that, to that effect. Ooh, let's read his letter. Oh no. How dare they? Titania, what's the matter? What letter say? Rise, take this letter to Oscar and tell him to prepare for combat and wait for me. I have to go out for a moment. Uh, but, Titania... I'll be right back. I'm counting on you. What on earth could that letter have said? Ooh, what's going on? Everyone, come quickly. <laughs> hey, Rise. So, how are you feeling? What is it? Why are you so agitated? Has something happened? It's Miss and Rolf. They, they've been taken by bandits. <gasps> what? <laughs> what? Are what are you talking about? The, the two of them went out early this morning to gather wildflowers. Sure, they're not back yet, but... Earlier, by the gate, a man asked me to deliver a letter to Titania. It was from a group of bandits, kidnappers. What are we going to do? Let me see it. Oh! If only I'd known. He didn't seem like a bad person. Hmm. I get it. They're after revenge. They want retribution for the other day at the village. Caldia, was it? Hmm. Taking children as hostages. What cowards. <laughs> Blast! <laughs> Wait. Ike. Where? Where do you think you're going? I'm going to get missed! But, no. Titania, she said she'd be right back. You're supposed to get ready and wait for her. And do you honestly think we've got time to wait? I'm going! What do you think you're going to do on your own, rookie? Hold it. I'm going to. Stop! 
Both of you. I'm I'm going with you. Oh, come on. Wait. This is crazy. What do you think? You can just ignore the deputy commander's orders. Yes, we can ignore those deputy commander's orders. The road forks here. Well, which way do we go? How am, how am I supposed to know that? Hold it. Are you saying you don't know where we're going? Unbelievable. You'd better learn to think before you act, you moron. Shut your mouth, Boyd. You think you can make me? Come on. But, but both of you, this is no time to be fighting. I, I figure we find you like this. What are you two doing? So you're coming after all? It's not like you two chambermaids to be disobeying orders. What in the world's co what's the world coming to? Oscar, you know this road, don't you? What way do we go? You're going to the bandit stronghold, right? That that's the left fork. Got it. I'm still talking here. Just let, let me finish what I Come on, Oscar, let's go to. I guess we've no choice. Uh, hey! You're not leaving me behind! Ba -ba 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 I like the music in this game. Ba -ba 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 hold. I wish them stupid bands would give them stupid voices. Ikanu. 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 Yeah, so you come, did you, boys? Is it just you then? You came alone? You seriously underestimate what we're capable of doing to you. Now, where's that snobby red-haired wench you read with? Titania's not here. It's just us. And all I want to know right now is whether Miss and Rolf are safe. Yeah, of course. Oh, yeah. yeah, of course. We've got him locked up safe and sound in that little shack back there. We got no problem with those brats. What we are after is a little revenge. We want the redhead and her pups. And that'd be you, boys. Then hurry up and let those two go. We're here, aren't we? You've got no more reason to hold them. You're here, but red ain't. We'll just keep the brats until she arrives. Dang it! If you're so impatient, I guess we can start by killing you whelps. You all ready for this? Oh, you all ready to die? Hey, come on out. It's time to play, lads. Oh, we want to play! We like play time! There. There are so many. But... We must not lose. Rise, move to the rear. <laughs> if anyone gets injured, we need you on hand with your staff. Understood. <laughs> Take them, lads. Without the red head knight, they're no match for us. What did you say, dirtbag? We'll make you regret those words. Yes, after all that talking, we finally get to play the chapter. Okay, so let's see who we got. Okay, yeah, Oscar, he has a sword, apparently. What's Paladin Band? Disarmament when equipped alters the direction of level upgrade. Okay. I don't know what these bands are for. Okay, he has Iron Axe, Iron Axe. Heal. Iron Sword, Iron Sword, Iron Sword. Okay. Let's see. I ho let's hope if Oscar can take this dude out. Okay, attack, Iron Lance. Yeah, that should be good. No damage, owned. I love Fire Emblem music. <coughs> Yay, vulnerabilities! 
Let's see. Let me slight these guys. You can... Cause if you... Oh, wait, hold on. Yeah. Oh, if you hit A on these guys, it'll show you all their range. And you can hit them all. Later games, you can just hit one button. It'll show you everybody's range. But in this game, you have to actually hit individual ones. But let's go. Oh, hey! You can actually... Okay. Wee! Okay. Let me... Go. Go. Ike. Yeah. Okay, good. Can Boyd? Yeah, let's see if Boyd can take this guy out. Yay! Oh, it's quite nice to take the damage. Level up. Let's see what we got for level up. Okay, that's pretty good. Okay. Let's bring Rise over here. Let him rise. It's a rise to action. <laughs> oh, let's see what's in that little shack. Okay. Oh, oh what am I getting Oh, a sniff. Keep your chin up, Wolf. Boys are supposed to cry. But I'm so scared. I do even a little bit scared, Mist. Of course I am, but listen, we'll be fine. My brother will definitely come rescue us. Yeah, you're white. And I'm sure that my brothers will be right there with them. I'm sure they will too. So no more crying, got it? Every phase is video. Okay, that's interesting. I thought we'd go after freaking boy, but okay. Urgh, urgh, yeah. That's what happens when you don't try to go after boy. You get iked. It's like decked, but iked. Okay, we got. Oh, yeah, actually, you can do that. Cool. You speed up. Okay, let's see. We'll do. See that guy? Oh, yeah! What about this guy? Ooh. Let's just see what I can do. E what about this guy? Uh, even worse. Okay. I'm just gonna, yeah, I'm just gonna do that. Boy can take care of the other guy. You hope for a critical or something. Okay. Oh, what about Oscar? Can Oscar reach these guys? No, I have a feeling not. Woo! Okay. Wait. Wait. Okay. Heal. Wait. No, I don't want Rise to go that close. Hold on. This is a bad guy. That's a bad guy. Those guys aren't in range, but I'm just gonna. No. They aren't in range, but I'm just gonna click them just to be safe. Okay, so I'm gonna have Boyd finish this guy off. I also have this making, recreating the music of this game, even though there's good music. Okay, so Rise is good right there, so wait. Okay. Attack this, bro. Uh oh. Good, ha! Ooh, didn't kill him, okay. I gotta check and see what the, how they are level-wise. <gasps> ah, the Jagan's back! I'm sure I told him to wait for me. I should have known to disobey orders. They have no discipline. As if you command the grail mercenaries, cannot allow any of our people to be harmed. Good. And you will protect your honors by sitting in the corner and not attacking. Because... Okay, I should explain what I meant earlier when I said she's a Jagan. What the term Jagan means is basically like, okay, look at them. The Ranger, Lance Knight, that's basically Cavalier. Fighter, Priest, and she's a Paladin. Basically, a Paladin is a class up of a Lan of what Oscar is, which is a Lance Knight. Actually, I think she was previously an Axe Knight. But basically, she's already classed up because each character, once they get hit a certain level, they class up. So that, she's already classed up and already, basically, if you look at their stats, her stats are like crazy high in comparison to everybody else's. 
And beca that, that, that's what the term Jagan means, basically a character they give you at the very beginning that has really high stats. But the problem is that she doesn't. her stat boosts don't go really high. She's one of the better of them, but every Fire Emblem game has at least one of these guys. Sometimes they have two. This game has two, actually, which I think the next one you get in the next chapter. But, uh, yeah, when I said Jagan, that's what I mean. So basically, it's a good thing to not use them, because if you use them too much, then they're going to steal all the early experience and... Your good units aren't going to be able to get enough experience early on, so... It's a good thing to be careful for the Jagans, like... They're good for emergencies, like... If you're, like, about to die and... There's nothing else you can do, then yeah, use a freaking Jagan. Go ahead. I'm going to have her move a little bit, but not too much, though. I'll have her go in this... Here, just go here. Okay. Rise, go right there. You can rise to the... Oh, I should have had Ike. Oh, okay. Okay... Go there, and next unit, go here. Da 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 Okay, so, let me have Rise heal him. Let him rise to the occasion, the Dark Knight Rises. Other Rise joke that I could use, but I'm too lazy to. Okay, let's see what you got. Um, what about boy, let's see. Yeah, here. Boyd, oh, no, I don't want Boyd to steal that experience, because I want freaking Ike to get experience! Actually, what about Oscar? What can Oscar do? Oscar buyer! Okay, that works. Even though this goes against the weapon triangle, which I'm not sure they probably explained the weapon triangle, but basically lances beat swords Swords beat axes, and axes beat lances. That's how the weapon triangle goes in this game. So basically, like, Ike here, because it shows like an up symbol here and a down symbol there. Basically, that means your weapon is superior. There are other weapons. I know, I'm not sure if this game has them, but there are weapons that actually go against weapon triangle. Like, there's an, there's a, there's a, there's an axe reaver, a lance reaver, and a sword reaver, which basically reverses it. So basically, it's like, specifically, like... An a sword reaver is specifically a sword that's strong against axes, or like, it'd be a lance reaver would be like an, or like, you know, you know how it goes. Okay. Let's see, you can just chill here. Actually, just, yeah, just, just chill right there. We're not really in an emergency yet, so you can just chill there. Uh, da -da. Miss, yes. Yes, yes, competition. Whoa, crits and grits! Ah! That was, I think, the that's the first critical I've gotten so far. Critical is basically... When, next time I show you, I'll kind of show you a little thing where it says the critical chance. But basically, a critical is basically a, ra basically a random chance where your attack will do triple damage. So if your attack was meant to do 10, it would do 30 damage. So it's, for the most part, in a lot of these games, basically a critical is an auto-kill, essentially. Let me see if I can show... I can route the enemy. Hold on. Let me... If he does, he need healing. Yeah, he needs a little bit of healing. Let's heal him. Can you get Rise leveled up? Because the only way that's the only thing I'm probably about priests is the only way they can heal level up is by freaking healing. So, here, let me show you with Ike real quick. See that basically where it says crit? That's basically his critical rate. So basically, with the critical, how the way the critical rate works is that basically like I said this. So with him, is basically a three percent chance that he'll critical this guy. So that's how it goes. Okay, want well, to explain that real quick? Attack Ikanahu or Inaku. Will you let the two of them go now? Sure, you can have them both. If you can beat me, that is. Okay. Boo. Oh. Oof. Okay. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Okay, so I'm gonna start advancing these guys closer. Oh no. You can just chill here. Okay. Chill there. Enemy phase. Uh oh! Where's he going? Where are you going? Boy, you crazy. What are you doing? <laughs> Boy, you crazy. What are you doing? What in Sam Hill's going on here? Oh, one thing I want to do really quick to. Can she show? I think she can. Let me see. Oh, no, she can. I think only floor units can shove. Yes. Shove rise. Yeah. That's why I love the shoving in this game. You just push him. 
See, that's really tactical. Like, oh, if I'm only like a step away, then you can just push him. And now I got healed again. Yay. Okay, so now also by moving there, he screwed himself over because he can go into thicket, which lowers his freaking hit rate by like, I think 10%. So let's freaking just destroy this guy then. Okay, good. This, this can't be. I don't deserve to lose to sell swords like you. How we finally leveled up this chapter? Nice. Oh, no strength boost. Okay. It's not a big deal getting a strength boost or anything. I don't know why it would be a big deal. All right, somehow we did it. Somehow. What do you mean, somehow? We did it because we are better than them. Boyd, calm yourself. What you did was a direct defiance of the orders I, su I explicitly gave you. How it all turned out is another issue altogether. De Deputy Commander, I, I take full responsibility. The failure is mine. Accept our apologies. Oscar, rise. What am I supposed to do with you two? <sighs> I think I'll leave you two to the commander. He'll know how to handle you, I'm sure. Oh, now let's find Miss and Rolf. According to the bandit chief, they're in that shack back. Eek. What? Missed. Look at this freaking axe, dude. Please let go. I said let go. That's her voice for now on. Missed. Pressure everywhere you came. Oh, I'm scared. I forgot his voice. Oh, yeah. Arms. Oh, I'm. I forgot. I already forgot his voice. It's the same freaking episode. Oh, I'm, I'm, I'm scared. Oh, yeah, like that. Rolf. Oscar, help me. Rolf, I'm here too. Boyd, what? Stop crying. You don't need to worry. We'll get you out of there. That's right. Buck up, buddy. Hey, they all have green hair. Oh, yeah, they're, I think they're all brothers. I like their hair. Uh, I'll try. You harm either of them or I'll see you dead. Oh, look at Mr. Purple Bandit. Shut up. Shut your stinking trap. If you want these two alive, you'll, you'll throw your weapons down. If you don't, I'll start with the girl. Eek! No! <laughs> Stop! Wait. Huh? Yeah. Oh. Yeah! Yeah! <laughs> I'm putting down my weapons. See? See, I played a sound effect. That means I put a weapon down. Yeah. Ha <laughs> ha! Smart move, wench. De Deputy Commander. We are here to save them. Now all of you, back off. Okay. But Dang! This stinks! <laughs> all right. So now you're on... Oh, what? this voice is weird. So you're unarmed. Which means all of you can do is watch while I got this whiny brat like a faddling pig. Why'd I turn to Bane all of a sudden? Sean Connery. Oh, hello. Ah, ah, ah. Oh, pfft. Ow. Uh, oh, oh, oh. I... Rolf, can you hear me? 
Mist! It's Rolf! It's he! He's fine. He just fainted is all. There's not a scratch on him. Who? Don't you do, don't do that on to me. I'm just glad to see you both alive and well. You're both so brave. Yep. Thanks. This guy's dead. This arrow. Who shot it? A single arrow, right between the eyes? Who else could make a shot like that? No one, that's who. That voice! It's Batman! That's not Batman at all! Don't you children owe me a little gratitude? I just saved your lives. Oh! I forgot about Gaytree. I gotta give him a voice. Um... What oh, what voice am I gonna give Gaytree? Um Oh I think he's um Oh yeah, he's like the perv of this game. I'll give him like a quagmire voice. <laughs> Deputy Commander! Sheon! <laughs> You're both so cruel with the cruel with the armor on. You know I can't run that fast. That's a bad quagmire voice. <laughs> Sheon! Gaytree! So that's where you went, Titania. Of course. I knew we'd need reinforcements. I'm glad it wasn't a waste of time. Well done, both of you. In the end, I've got to feather someone. So it was worth the rush. <laughs> All I <laughs> did was sweat. That was <laughs> hard work. Yeah. Brother! Mist, you did well, sis. You must have been frightened. Uh huh. Uh, uh huh. I ever stopped believing. I knew that you and the others would come and rescue us. I knew you'd come. So, I was fine. Really? That's an improvement to your usual sobbing and nose running. You jerk! I my nose does not run. All right, come on, let's head for home. My goodness, what a day this has been! You're like a sensual voice. All right, save. We <laughs> room.